So that was an amazing. <sighs> it's just a little cold. What's up, P Nation? Today we're in Pasadena, California, the city of the mountains. We didn't know there were going to be so mountains when we came down the road, but this place is truly spectacular. Today we're going to try and hike and find some snow. So just walking around Pasadena, it's like really, really lovely. It has this kind of like art deco vibe going on, which we associate with the Texas State Fair, but it's kind of like how in Palm Springs, they were like, like all the buildings were like one kind of architectural style. Like everybody was on board with this one style. It's the same here, but with like Art Deco. It's really cool. All right, now we're trying to get some bakery items at our favorite bakery it's called 85 Degrees. They used to have the best egg tarts, but it's coronavirus season, so who knows if we can get them. This is new. Oh my god, it looks amazing. They have cookies now? Oh, these are our favorite back in the day. We might have to get one. Hey, Do you want to get a char one? No. Do you want to get a raisin up? No. Raisin up? Raisin up? Raisin up? Raisin up? Raisin up? No. Coffee? No. Nope. Okay. So we got our egg tart. It's only $1.90, which is such a steal of a deal because these things are like so good. And now we're gonna head to my car. We have brought a lunch because we're always on a budget and we're gonna eat in the park. Pasadena tastes great. It's beautiful here. It's a little bit chilly. It just snowed up in the mountains like a lot. So our whole plan today was like get up here, see Pasadena, it's beautiful, and then to escape up into the mountains so we can go hiking. But like we forgot to bring a hiking like backpack and there's a ton of snow so we don't know how successful our hiking trip is going to be. So we're just trying to enjoy lunch and like bask in the sun as much as possible before we get up there and we're just gonna see what happens. It might be a complete bust, but it might also be an amazing hiking day. Now I feel like I'm all energized, ready to go on this hike. Time for this egg tart. We could've gone to Chinatown for our first LA egg tart, but here we are. It's like way too indulgent for the healthy meal we just ate. It's really good. Mm. So good. Best egg tart you ever had? I don't think you're gonna get me. <gasps> That's okay. Honest. Really? Yeah. Okay, good. I got like four more of these. I really forgot how good they were. We were in China, we got six one time, and I ate five of them. Over there looks kind of yeah. like it's gonna storm, but we don't care because we're in the mountains, and I feel like I'm in Colorado right now. It's probably the flannel and the cold weather and it's the sun the being and the so weather. intense. <laughs> but we're gonna head up the mountain now. Lunch is amazing. Let's do this. It's beautiful. Look at that. Wow. Boom! We made it. There's a Rose Bowl. One of my favorite memories as a child is watching the Texas Longhorns win their championship in here in 2005. And so it just feels so surreal to be standing here where Vince Young ran the touchdown in. Like, it is truly an amazing setting. The mountains are beautiful. They are calling us. We must go on this hike. Like, I am so excited. I think I have too much energy to go hiking. Let's do it. Look at this, look at this. I don't know if Leo's little car is gonna make it up, but apparently we're going up that and then somehow hitting the ridge. All right, we have started our ascent up this mountain, but apparently lots of parts of the road are closed, so. We don't know what's gonna happen. <laughs> we're gonna try to make it up as far as possible because we wanna see some snow. Like we are so close to downtown Los Angeles, it's kind of crazy that it could snow this close to the ocean. Yeah, and also I was really looking forward to this hike because it looked beautiful. But yeah, we haven't been outside like on a really nice hike. And especially not one with snow on it. I mean, this is California. What's going on? Southern California, yeah. Two thousand feet. 
Already? Yeah, that's what I just said. What? Endelie's National Forest. You guys, this is incredible. We live in Dana Point and we've gone through our little, I don't even know, our little canyon that I thought was gigantic. This is huge. I mean, we are in the mountains. It is breathtaking. I'm really like shocked that this is as close to Los Angeles and I didn't realize that it was this high and I don't know what I was expecting, but I didn't think it was this beautiful. Yeah, I didn't think it was gonna be this big. I mean, I don't know what I was expecting because we were literally coming up on these mountains seeing snow and we haven't even seen snow like from where we're driving. Yeah. So this just must be the most big, the, this just, this must just be, this just must be. See the altitude sickness comes to you really quickly. <laughs> okay. And like, we are so high so quickly. I'm just quickly. trying to say, we're really high up here and we like, this is a huge mountain range is what I'm trying to say. I actually started feeling like a little sick because we <laughs> gained so much elevation so quickly. Oh. You know what I mean? So altitude sickness is happening. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm fine. <laughs> Fingers crossed, let's hope so. We gotta go on this hike. We made it all the way up here. This was a beautiful drive. Literally the entire time Zach and I were like, oh my God, oh my God, how have we never done this before? Oh my God, now we can bring people up here. This would be so cool to do with other people. We should come back here and do this. So. We have found a new favorite in the Los Angeles area. This is like just north of Pasadena. This is so cool. We had no idea that Angeles National Park was this awesome. Got some cold, but like we have to remind ourselves that we lived in Antarctica for five months. So like, if we just bring ourselves back to that, it's in me. I have this. No. Ah! <laughs> We're on this trail. Well, it's actually a road and it's like blocked off because you need chains on your car. You can park. And now we're walking up this road. It's really cold. And this is only a rain jacket. Ah! So that was enough Woo! hiking. It's just a little cold. I mean, we're <laughs> just ready for Los Angeles in the winter, which does not mean snow, but apparently today it does. Whew, we were ill prepared. <laughs> Not enough jackets, not enough pants, not enough gloves, hats, scarves. Yeah, this woman just walked up the hill in her parka and Uggs, and I was like, oh, <laughs> that's what we're getting into. I had no idea it was Canada this close to Los Angeles, but like, whatever. So, overall, we were unprepared. But, <laughs> <laughs> but this Pasadena day was amazing. It has opened our eyes to like so many different parts of Los Angeles we never thought were even a thing. I don't know, I just thought it was an ocean city, but it's clearly a mountain town too. Well, I just didn't know Pasadena was like even that close to Los Angeles. Yeah. Like it's not even like a 30 minute drive away. It's yeah. so close. Yeah. So yeah, this was like a day of discovery for us um, and I really enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. And there's a dinosaur with a moving tail. Like, how much cooler could Pasadena get? And like, bask in the sun as much as possible. There's a fat squirrel! Oh my god! And it was on Switzer Trail, like Switzerland. We've never been to Switzerland. Switzerland. I made that connection. I, yeah. Yeah, I got the brains.